Well, Walt, basically they're here for one reason, and that's to take the pressure off of staff members at these hospitals that are already overwhelmed due to the surge in COVID cases. We actually just saw the Department of Defense medical team walk in right behind me here at Dameron Hospital. I would say maybe about an hour and a half ago. In fact, we have some video of that. Take a look at this right here. So here's what we know. There's a total of 39 medical personnel on that team, including doctors, nurses, and other staff members. They will be split up between Dameron Hospital and Adventist Health Lodi Memorial. And the goal is to use their help in order to expand ICU capacities. I had a chance to catch up with operations executive over both hospitals who is relieved to have their presence here. Take a listen. Them arriving today means it's a little ray of hope for all of us in the county. Uh, the county EMS team worked very hard in helping us get this team here, both teams, one at Lodi and one at Dameron. This will allow our ICU capacities at both facilities to expand. So as you hear, just a sigh of relief for them. Now they expect an expansion of at least 20 beds between both facilities. Now this will allow them to accept transfers from other hospitals in the county for COVID and non COVID patients. Now, Walt, I am being told that the medical team, they will be in orientation for at least the next 48 hours. So they will start seeing patients as early as Saturday morning. Now in all, they will be here until uh, mid February. So at least a couple of months from now. Now, Walt. All right, Kevin, you said that the uh, military was coming and you had pictures that they were walking into the hospital with the backpacks. Kevin, thank you. Live in Stockton today.